And so that's the big encouragement that I have today for you is to remember that you don't need to be the next Mark Twain if you're a writer. You don't need to be the next Van Gogh if you're a painter. You don't need to be the next Ninja if you're a streamer or the next Markiplier or PewDiePie if you're a YouTuber. You need to be you. And you are enough. You are unique and offer something that no one else can. There will be some cool music that goes with this. It's not here yet, but it will be here soon. Howdy ho everyone, it is me, Nathan. I just wanted to get on here and talk to you guys for a minute because it's been a while since we've done one of these. I wanted to talk to you a little bit about what's going on in my life and I wanted to encourage you. So essentially, there was a time period not very long ago that I wasn't sure what I was doing or where I wanted to go or what I wanted to be doing. And I wasn't sure if doing YouTube anymore was something that I was able to do or that I was wanting to do and I wasn't sure if I was supposed, how I was supposed to approach it. And really, honestly, I've worked through most of those things now. See, we all have talents, we all have abilities, and they're all different than other people's. But we like to try to put ourselves in the very generic box that everyone else fits in, which really no one fits in. This idea that we're supposed to have a specific type of job or a specific type of success in life. It wasn't working very well for me. And to be honest, I was kind of struggling trying to figure out why it wasn't working for me to to just have a normal job and just do normal things and then i realized that i'm made to encourage people and motivate people and and have relationships with people and i wasn't able to do that with the work that i was doing and so now that i'm doing this again i feel so much better it's i'm i'm where i'm supposed to be and that may sound strange to you, but I truly believe that we're each given talents that are uniquely created for specific tasks, for specific jobs, for specific ideas. And each one of us can provide a unique take on things and provide unique art and unique encouragement and motivation to other people. And so for me, doing this is just so very important because it's something that I truly feel that I wasn't just that I, it's not just something that I feel like I'm decent at. It feels like something that I was made to do. I'm, I am here to talk to you, to encourage you, and to use these talents that I have been given to do this, to encourage and entertain. And there are other things that I could do with the abilities that I have for sure. And I do try to do some of those things too. But this is the best, this is the best thing that I could find that allows me to do that is doing YouTube and streaming and stuff. And so I wanna have a larger focus on my channel, uh, on who I am as a person and my relationship with God and, and my life. And I wanna have a, a larger emphasis on motivating and encouraging you guys. So expect more vlogs like this, where I talk to you personally about what's going on in my life and what's going on in your lives. But I also love to entertain. It's a big part of who I am and it's something that I need. I need a, a good vent for that and so, being able to do my gaming videos and stuff like that and, and occasionally skits and stuff when I come up with good ideas and have the time is really important to me being able to do that. So that's that's why this channel is so important to me is that, you know, one of our big things is that games are art and art is important. And I think that one of the cool things about that concept, I think one of the cool things about what we do here, which is mostly playing indie horror games and stuff, is that I'm, I'm finding people where they're at, people who have made games, people who have worked hard on something, and I'm able to see their art that they have created, the, the things that they have poured their heart into, and I'm able to then reach out to them and say, hey, you did a great job on these things, keep up the good work. And you know, if I have some criticisms, then criticisms are good for us, you know? They help us build into better people, so, so you know, I'm perfectly comfortable with the with giving out criticisms or receiving criticisms while I do it. So to me, the whole channel revolves around this idea of finding people and finding them where they're at and in their art and encouraging them because you personally, it doesn't matter if you're a game developer, it doesn't matter if you're an artist, 
doing paintings or drawings, it doesn't matter if you write books, it doesn't matter if you sing or play music, it doesn't matter if you make YouTube videos or stream, whatever it is that you do, you offer a completely unique brand that no one else in the world can offer. You are the only you that there will ever be. And so that's the big encouragement that I have today for you is to remember that you don't need to be the next Mark Twain if you're a writer. You don't need to be the next Van Gogh if you're a painter. You don't need to be the next Ninja if you're a streamer or the next Markiplier or PewDiePie if you're a YouTuber. You need to be you. And you are enough you are unique and offer something that no one else can. And so what you need to do is, is really lean into and focus on the things that you are truly talented at and show other people your art by, by showing them what you can do in a loving way. And so that's the motivation and the, and the encouragement that I give you today is be the best you whatever that means. Focus in on whatever makes you unique and and share people, share with people that uniqueness. Because I believe wholeheartedly that every single one of us was created with certain talents and abilities that are completely unique to us. And yeah, maybe there's somebody else who has a similar set of talents that maybe even is better than you at some of them, but they're not you. So you are gonna make it unique. You're gonna make it different. So start searching for that thing that makes you you. Share it with other people because that's why you were given that talent. That's why God made you the way he made you is so that you would use the talents that he gave you. And the, the verse of, of a couple of days ago, because uh, I don't know if you were all watching, but a couple of videos ago I said we're going to start doing memory verses here on the channel because that's really important to me and it's not really as much for you guys. Of course, I hope that it gives you some encouragement and stuff. but. It's for me, it's something that, that allows me to put a little bit more of, of who I am into my videos, is uh, it was 1 Corinthians 10 31, which, which says, therefore, whether you eat or drink or sleep or whatever you do, do all things for the glory of God. And that's just integral to this idea, me doing this channel, you sharing your art and with other people, whatever it is that you do, because you were given those talents, so use them to, to help people because that's, that's what we were made to do, is share our, our art, our talents, and our love with other people and encourage them and help them. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it encourages you and uh, there will be more normal videos coming out later in the week. Uh, I know this video is a little, out a little later today. It's just been one of those days where between missing sleep last night and the things that I had to get done today. It was hard to get things done before now, um, but here we go. So, <laughs> All right, well, I hope you all enjoyed this video. I hope it encourages you. Let me know down in the comments below what your talents are. What are things that make you unique? And it doesn't have to be one specific thing. Like that was one of my issues when I was younger is trying to figure out what it was that I was talented at and I couldn't figure it out. And then when I got older, I realized that I was just moderately good at a handful of things, including entertaining people. And that really comes in handy when you're a writer, producer, director, photographer, and actor all in one. And that's, that's what I needed to be to be this. Oh, an editor, of course. Um, but it was really difficult to figure out what that one talent was that I had because I didn't have one talent. Like I wasn't the best at sports, you know, I wasn't the, the star basketball player or whatever, but I had a bunch of little things and the little things make you make up you. You don't have to be the best at one thing because being great at a bunch of random things or decent at thousands of things or whatever it is that you are makes up who you are and that's good. That's a good thing because that combination is a unique, beautiful, wonderful thing. It's like the 23 flavors in Dr. Pepper, you know? It's the herbs and spices in the Kentucky Fried Chicken. It's whatever it is, however you wanna say it. All of those things, those secret herbs and spices blend together to make unique people and not any one of them is defined by the one thing that they do well. They are who they are. The, the sum of their parts made up to do specific things. 
to encourage people, to love people, and to share their art with the world. And yeah, you're gonna have a job. Yeah, you're gonna, you're gonna have to pay the bills. You're gonna have to do those things. But that doesn't mean that you can't do the things that you were made to do next to that job. So remember, you are important. You are unique. You are a work of art. And for now, this is Nathan Blake signing off for Nathan Blake Games. Sayonara. Hey everybody, it's Nathan. I hope this video was an encouragement to you. If you're still here, then I guess you must have really enjoyed the video or you just forgot to turn it off or something. Either way, if you're hearing this message, then it would really uh, do a lot for me if you would share this video with someone else who needs some encouragement. Um, because if, if you listened to it this far, I imagine it encouraged you too. So thank you all so much for being here. And as always, we will see you in the next one. Sayonara.